Once, pugs had noses and spines that let them breathe and run like any other dog, until humans began reshaping them for beauty. In the Victorian era, breeders competed for shorter snouts and tighter curls, every litter designed to look a little cuter than the last. Brothers bred with sisters, generations locked inside the same bloodline, chasing perfection at the cost of survival. Each generation the snout shortened, the skull compressed, the airway narrowed, until breathing itself became a struggle. Their faces flattened, their eyes pushed forward, their tails curled into their own spines, evolution reversed by human hands. Now many can't sleep without gasping. They wake choking, hearts racing, trapped inside the body we designed for them. Every new litter makes the problem worse. Smaller faces, shallower airways, shorter lives. Scientists now call it a genetic bottleneck. A beautiful breed collapsing under the weight of its own design. We didn't just breed smaller dogs, we bred suffering into existence and called it love.